Hello everyone, my name is Gifty and welcome to my channel, The Dare's Delight. On today's episode, we are going to have fish stew today. So to start with, we're going to have some ginger, some spring onions, some green bell peppers, some green chilies, some scotch bonnet and some fresh dill. And I'm going to add some salt and all-purpose seasoning. You can use any seasoning of your choice. And I'm going to add some oil, which I'm using sunflower oil. You can use any oil of your choice. I'm going to blend everything together. And now we're about to season our fish. Here I'm using some red snapper. You can use any fish of your choice. You can use tilapia, mackerel, any fish that you want, you can use it. So now I'm about to season the fish with my ginger blend. Let's just call it green blend, yes. And I'm adding about three tablespoons. And I also added some fresh lemon, which takes the fishy smell out of it. And I'm going to make sure we coat everything with the seasoning. And I also had some cuts through the fish to make sure the flavors infuse in our fish. So now we're about to fry our fish. So here I have some sunflower oil and I'm infusing my oil with some bay leaves, some garlic, some shallot and some star anise, which is going to give our fish more flavor. Yes. So I'm going to sprinkle a bit of flour so our fish doesn't stick together. We want our fish to be firm and looking delicious, yes. That fish needs to look good and tasty. So this is the trick, you need to infuse your oil to make sure your fish tastes delicious. So as you can see, our fish is done, it's looking golden brown. As you can see, it's still intact, it's not hair. So this is the trick, you need to use it. Please don't forget all the ingredients is listed down below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. And we are going to repeat the process again and cook it for about 10 minutes and the fish will be done. And now we are about to start with our stew. We are using the same oil we used in frying our fish because that oil is infused with so much flavor. So I just left some oil on the side and I left my bay leaves and my star anise but I just took my garlic and onion out and now I had some sliced shallots and I'm adding my ginger blend, yes our green blend to our sauce and we are going to cook it for about 5 minutes. You know there's no water in our recipe so this tea is going to be quick and delicious. As you can see, our blend has been cooking for about five minutes now. And now I did a teaspoon of curry powder and tomato paste as well. And we are going to mix everything together and let it cook for about five to ten minutes. So whilst our tomato paste is cooking, we are going to have our tomato blend. In my blender, I have some shallot onion, some scotch bonnet chilies, some chopped tomatoes and some red bell peppers can use any bell peppers that you want. I'm using the red one for this recipe. And I'm gonna add some oil and make sure I blend everything together. So our tomato paste has been cooking for about five to 10 minutes now. And we're gonna add our tomato blend, mix everything together and leave it to cook for about 20 to 25 minutes. When you see that extra oil on top, then our stew will be done. So as you can see, our stew is almost done. You can see that extra oil on top. So now I'm gonna add some vegetables to the stew. I'm adding some sliced carrot, and I'm gonna add some green bell peppers as well, and the red, and I'm gonna add some shallots. Yes, we're gonna infuse this vegetable with a sauce. And I'm telling you, it's going to be delicious. I'm adding some nutmeg and all pepper seasoning. You can use any seasoning of your choice as well. So we're going to cook this for just about five minutes. So as you can see, our uh, vegetables have been cooking for five minutes now. I don't want it very soft, I want it a bit crunchy. So now we can add our fish. Yes, the fish is the last bit for the stew. 
we are going to put our fish in our stew to infuse the stew in our fish and cover our fish with the stew to leave it to cook for about five to ten minutes and i'm telling you this fish stew is going to be delicious our stew is done please don't forget to subscribe to my channel i love you all bye bye